Here's our first example of solving one of these second order differential equations. We have y double prime minus 6y prime plus 9y equals 0. The first step is going to be to write the characteristic equation. Remember that we replace y double prime with r squared. We replace y prime with r and replace y with 1 and that gives us the characteristic equation. It's just that easy. Then we need to solve this. If we needed to, we could fall back on the quadratic formula, but it turns out that factoring is relatively simple here. So if we factor this, we get r minus 3 times r minus 3, or r minus 3 squared equals 0, which means we have a single real answer for r, r equals 3. If you remember, this is what we called case 2 earlier, which specifically is the one where we had to worry about the linearly independent solutions, specifically y1 equals e to the rt, 3t in this case, and y2 equals t e to the rt. Since r equals 3, those are our two solutions, which means that our final answer for y is going to be this linear combination of these two. And that's really all there is to it. It's simply a matter of solving a quadratic equation and then checking the type of solution and selecting the right answers for y1 and y2 given the value of r.